7th of September in the evening on a Friday. And we're picking the white grapes from our vines, which have been particularly lush this year. Stephen has the a theory. Been very large, indeed. Um, I don't know if you can see many. In fact, what I can do is prepare a bunch I picked earlier. There you go. These are quite large. Yes. And they're uh, bang on. Lovely. And um, very sweet, delicious. One of the things we suffered from previously was mould growing on the grapes, but um, I um, read up something on, on the internet about um, allowing sufficient air to pass through the grapes, so uh, I uh, pruned back a lot of the foliage this year, earlier on, and um, we've hardly got any mould at all here now, even though we've had a fair amount of rain directly on the vines. Um, yeah, so a very good crop indeed. Absolute yes. Just yummy. And I mean, they are. Do you think they're technically eating grapes, honey? They might be because they're so sweet. They are very sweet. And there's hardly any pips, but there are a few. Yeah, a few pips. This, it's mm. the bef They were probably planted before the, you know the genetically engineered grapes where you had no pits mm. but they're very sweet tasting uh, last year mm. the the red grapes were very prolific yes. I mean look at that that's just they're gorgeous absolutely gorgeous mm. look at that just the, that's about part oh. of the best they're it's really the just there, fantastic. They're at, yeah, as Stephen know, says, good. yeah, they're at their peak. Oh, that leaf is covered in bird poo. So Def that was something else I did. I Def trimmed a lot of the leaves up from around the sides of the bunches, but I did leave a kind of canopy over the top uh, to keep um, a lot of bird poo off and stuff. Um, mm. That, I think, would limit a fair amount of the sunshine on the grapes, but it doesn't seem to have affected the flavour. So, well, that's fine. So we're not making wine with these, are we? I don't know, honey. Maybe Do you think year. we should make wine, or should we try to make jelly or jams? Um, well, I don't know. Liqueurs? First thing I think we need to do is get down. Yeah, yeah. We, we need to actually pick them, because I, I tried to pick as many as I could um, last night, because I could tell they were reaching their peak. But um, I'm not very good at ladders uh, with my knees. So um, fortunately, it's Friday in Stephen's home here in Southwest France. And um, well, let's face it, uh, he's much more able-bodied than I am, particularly on ladders. So we're trying to get them down and um, just look at recipes and try to decide what to do with them. I mean. A lot of people have asked us if we were going to make wines from them, and we certainly have plenty to do that with, but um, we don't actually have the apparatus.